What did China just find on the far side of the moon? This discovery wasn't just unexpected. It could completely change what we think we know about the moon and its untapped potential. Curious about why this could matter to the future of humanity? Or even the gaming metaverse? Stick around because things are about to get wild. What's so special about China's far side moon exploration? Most countries, like the United States and even the Soviet Union during the space race, concentrated their attention on the near side of the moon, the part always visible from Earth. China, however, decided to tackle something much more challenging, the hidden, mysterious far side. This decision alone set the country apart in modern lunar exploration and revealed an ambition to go where no other nation had seriously attempted sustained exploration before. Now let's back up a bit and talk about why the far side of the moon is such a big deal. Unlike the near side, which has been relatively well studied thanks to earlier missions and lunar landings, the far side faces away from Earth. This means it never gets direct communication with ground stations here. Simply put, mission control can't send or receive signals in real time, which complicates every step of the process. That's not the only challenge, though. The far side is also marked by massive impact craters and mountainous terrain, making it a difficult spot to land virtually anything safely. It remains shrouded in mystery, yet holds clues that scientists believe might deepen our understanding of the Moon's formation and even the history of our planetary system. To unlock that potential, China launched its Chang program, named after the Chinese Moon Goddess. The Chang missions have been nothing short of groundbreaking, with Chang-4 being the first to achieve a soft landing on the far side in 2019. Once there, it deployed what has become one of its most famous innovations, the U-22 rover. This autonomous lunar rover didn't just break records for being the first to explore the far side. It came equipped with advanced tools to study the moon in ways never attempted before. Exploring the far side required some creative technology. You might have heard about relay satellites before, but China designed and launched one specifically for this mission called Qichao. It essentially acts as a bridge, bouncing signals between the rover and Earth. That's what makes this mission stand out. It wasn't just about reaching a new destination, but figuring out how to sustain communication and operations in an area most deemed too problematic to explore. But why is the far side of the moon so intriguing? Apart from its inaccessibility, it's also distinct from the near side. The far side has a thicker crust and fewer maria, the vast dark plains formed by ancient volcanic activity. This suggests a different geological history, which could hold key insights into how the moon evolved. Could it even reveal information about early conditions in the solar system? Scientists think so. They've found the far side's environments to be less disrupted by Earth's interference, meaning its surfaces may hold purer evidence of its past. China's U-22 rover is equipped with cutting-edge technology to make these discoveries possible. It features autonomous navigation systems, which allow it to make decisions about its path without relying too much on input from Earth. It even uses AI to analyze its surroundings, identifying spots that are most likely to offer valuable samples or unique data. And let's not forget its advanced spectrometers and radar systems that look beneath the surface to understand what's hiding underground. It's the same kind of innovation that hasn't just helped China explore the moon, but shifted global perspectives on space exploration entirely. This leads us to the broader picture, how these missions are shaking up the space race dynamics. For decades, lunar exploration was dominated by NASA and the former Soviet Union. But now, with China's success on the moon, space exploration feels less like a club of specific nations and more like a global competition. China's advancements in space tech have raised the stakes, pushing other deep-pocketed players like the United States and even private companies such as SpaceX to rethink their strategies. It's no longer about just landing on the moon, it's about sustaining operations collecting advanced data and discovering resources that could reshape our future. And speaking of discoveries, China's work on the far side has already yielded some unexpected findings. 
the U-22 rover uncovered fascinating new data about lunar soil composition, revealing it's richer in certain materials than previously thought. Over time, the rover has also measured radiation levels, which are critical for understanding what it would take to set up a lunar base. These breakthroughs underline the importance of taking on the challenge of exploring the far side, and show the value of pushing past technological and logistical limits. But that's not where the surprises stop. In fact, China's missions have just scratched the surface of what might be waiting on the far side. One particular discovery made by U-22 has raised more questions than answers, and it involves some exotic materials scientists didn't expect to find. Could this discovery redefine how we think about lunar resources? Or maybe even rewrite what we know about the Moon's formation? We're about to find out. What if the Moon is hiding something that could revolutionize not just space exploration, but entire industries here on Earth? China's U-22 rover stumbled upon something that has scientists buzzing. Strange glass-like minerals scattered across the far side surface. At first glance, they might not seem like much, but these materials could provide a glimpse beneath the Moon's surface, possibly hinting at an untapped, resource-rich layer waiting to be explored. The discovery was so unexpected because these minerals don't fit the typical picture of what scientists thought they would find on the Moon. Lunar glass, which forms from ancient impacts or volcanic activity, isn't rare. But the samples U-22 analyzed had unique structures and chemical compositions, suggesting they originated from deeper layers of the Moon's crust. Being able to access materials from the Moon's interior like this has never been possible before, and it's forcing researchers to rethink what they know about its geological history. Could it mean the Moon's interior is far richer in elements than previously assumed? If so, this challenges long-held theories about how the Moon formed and evolved over billions of years. That's what makes all this so exciting. These findings aren't just minor scientific tweaks. They could have practical implications. For example, the Moon is known to have deposits of helium-3, a rare isotope not abundant on Earth but highly coveted for its potential use in future nuclear fusion. Unlike traditional nuclear energy, which creates long-lived radioactive waste, helium-3 fusion could provide clean, efficient, and sustainable energy. These unexpected and unusual materials could help identify areas where helium-3 is more concentrated, giving scientists clues about where to mine it. The far side of the moon might just hold the secret to humanity's next big leap, not only in space exploration, but in transforming how industries like tech and gaming operate. Imagine a world where your favorite games are hosted on servers powered by helium-3 from lunar mining, or where space-driven discoveries enable advancements in virtual reality and AI systems. It's not science fiction. It's a future being built right now. So, what role will you play in this unfolding reality? The moon's mysteries are only beginning to reveal themselves, and the implications could redefine life on Earth and beyond. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe for more content just like this. Got questions or something you want to add? Drop a comment below. I read them all. And if you're curious about what's coming next, make sure to turn on the notification bell so you never miss an update. See you in the next one.